Hello everybody, welcome back for another episode of Spongebob Battle for Bikini Bottom. Last time we started up Sand Mountain. This time we're gonna cruise down Gup uh not Guppy Hill, uh Fla Flounder Mound. Or Flounder Hill. There you go, it's Flounder Hill. I don't know where I'm getting my ideas. Anyway, we're gonna go down it one more time because uh we need to get these uh snowmans. We need to get the snowmen because uh They're oh Jesus almost died. They are begging to be found, so uh, I'm gonna find them. Uh, I'm pretty sure I need to go down the uh, right path here. Which every time I do this, I'm getting a freaking goddamn ass load of shiny objects, which are always helpful for uh, for later things. Uh, you could take so many shortcuts, but no. No, not with the snowmen. You, you can't take shortcuts, otherwise you miss them. Uh, anyway, now I can be friggin' meticulous with this, cause, uh... I don't know where I'm going. Uh... Does a sponge good? Uh, maybe it does. Is that Kelpo? I don't know if it is. I don't know. What's the SpongeBob's? Uh, not the SpongeBob. <laughs> SpongeBob eats SpongeBob. <laughs> that kind of doesn't make any sense. I don't know. He probably could eat himself if he felt like it. He would just grow back, right? I don't know. Oh, right. No, he has done that before. <laughs> In Graveyard Shift, he ate his arms over and over. Yeah, so technically SpongeBob has ate himself in situations. Fitting? Uh, let's go to the right. I'm out of fucked up. Let's go over here. Oh, Jesus, no, okay. So I only got one more snowman. Jesus Christ, where are these things at, man? They're one of the most confusing spots. Oh, trust me, I'm gonna find them. I'm gonna find them. Maybe one's over here, just chilling out. I don't know, this could risk death, but who knows. I've got a... I know, checkpoint, I know, I got you. Okay, I got you, bro. Just, 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 just chill out. <laughs> <sighs> oh, okay, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna slowly walk out the door here, you know, just, just, okay. Hold on, I'm, I'm leaving, I'm, I'm gonna leave. I'm leaving! I am certainly leaving! Okay, I get in the box! Get in the box! Okay, I didn't leave. You know, I, I really wanted to leave, but I, could, I can't do that in front of all y'all. Okay, so where the fuck do I go? Uh... I feel like if I hop down here, but then not jump, there's gonna be a snowman. And there isn't. So I don't get get it. There's some jumps over there. Hmm. Oh, it's essentially that. Okay. So all I have left is just going left at that one area. Unless there's other areas and shortcuts that I missed. This literally only has that. Oh god, it almost slipped off. If I die, then just fucking I'm gonna do this shit off screen. And I'll just like learn where the fuck all these snowmen are. Cause dear Jesus, they're like in such back ass locations. So we're gonna try going to the left. Okay, there's one. But then where's the last one?
Oh! Fuck. No. 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 Really? After all of that work. Oh. Fuck. Okay. That's it. I'm gonna try this shit one more time to get all eight of these things without consulting a guide. Okay. This shit requires multiple playthroughs. Re it mandates multiple playthroughs. Okay, go over here, over here, jump, jump, yump. I'm gonna go over here. No jumping at all. Hit the snowman. Okay. It's the end of that. Alright, accelerate it for the jump. Ah, oh, yeah, that sound effect's funny. I don't know, to some degree it's funny. It looks like there's a path down there, but there isn't. I don't know, maybe that's where the last- No! Fuck this game. Fuck this game. Fuck this game. Fuck this game. I'm not even- Nuh-uh. No, I'm just gonna- I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna freaking wait. Nuh-uh. There's no point. No. I- I give up on that. Really? The thing skewed my angle on purpose just so I'd have to do it one more time. <laughs> nah, uh-uh. Not even, not even gonna bother. That's the most waste, that's the biggest waste of my time there could ever be. Y you thought, you thought all of this other shit before was a waste of time. You haven't seen anything! You have seen nothing! Nothing! Sand Mountain. I have almost 4,000. Like, I guess this shit is easier to make up. Maybe it is. I don't know. Okay. Sand Mountain. Yeah. He's so muscular that he can go down a mountain. Ten bucks. That's bullshit. Okay. See, there's no snowman up here. Fucking nowhere. They're absolutely goddamn nowhere. Because if they were, it would actually make sense. Okay. But at least I'm hitting the heckles out of these goddamn uh, shortcuts. Get these shortcuts all day, every day! Fuck you, Larry, I'm gonna get your time. Or just die, or just fucking die trying to make a simple jump. A simple jump on a gosh dang spring, I can't do. I mean, you know, it's, it's that easy. Just fucking, really, just, just, just jump off, don't even hit the spring, just die. I'm the fastest sloper there ever was, except no I'm not, because WHY THE you should be able to jump once. That should not require a full double jump to just hit a gosh dang spring. You, you can't. If you jump once, you're too low. If you if you jump, if you jump um just once, you go too low. If you jump twice, uh you go you go to you. Yeah, if you jump once, you undershoot it. If you jump twice, you overshoot it. Watch. Okay, never mind. You have to jump twice every time. Now the shortcuts are real. Oh, Larry, you're making me angry. Really, really angry. Like, wow, this challenge is pissing me off. The thing is, you would think a level with just nothing but slide levels would be fun. And the slide levels are fun. However... Fucking travesty sometimes. Uh, yeah. 
pretty much the one time on the slope stages that they want you to swap over to Sandy. Alright, so then take this uh, snowball and it crashes into there. And if you know what you're doing, shortcut! There you go. Big, gigantic shortcut. It's pretty easy at this point. Oh, sorry, Wood. I forgot the clock was even ticking. What? what? What the hell's going on, man? <laughs> You've never seen a sloper this good. Have you ever seen someone slope this good? <laughs> My name is Alfred Wilcox, and I am the best sloper I ever was. Let me tell you, upon my days of sloping, that I could beat any other sloper. Within a 10 mile radius? Are you serious? Okay, fine. You know what? It's fine. I'm sick of listening to the. Oh, wait. What? Wow, this thing is chugging like a gosh dang. Fucker at a bar. Jesus fuck. That joke was awful. Let me. Let me. Let me just exit life real quick. Okay, you know what? <laughs> I'm not gonna do the same joke again. Nah. Oh, come on. Would you? I mean, really, stop. I mean, I swear to God, Chucks are almost as bad as the Crusher droids from Star Wars Episode Three. Like, I swear to God, they're almost that bad. Okay! It's fine. We've got 52, soon to be 53 golden spatulas. And then I'm gonna go around and scrape at whatever socks I could have. And that uh, other sock with Sandy. Ta-da! Golden spatula! There you go. Ow! Okay, so now we're gonna hop over here to Sandy. We're just gonna skedaddle. Because we're gonna go over here. Which, honestly, playing a Sandy in these levels might actually be better, because she actually keeps her hover. So, you know, it allows you to do big old massive jumps like that. But, yeah, she's pretty much the only character in this game that actually has a board when they go sliding, so... Uh-uh, Sandy. You're supposed to meet with Destiny. Get on this springboard and meet Destiny. Okay! I see that you do not want to fulfill the destiny of uh, Alfred Wilcox. Wow! I've never seen such a display! I mean... I mean, legit, that was a fool... Execution from slope to springboard to icy platform. How did you manage that? By being awesome. Fuck you, Chuck. <laughs> oh, I fucking hate Chucks. There you go. Okay, we're done with Sand Mountain. I'm, I'm done with this level. I don't want to play it anymore. Yeah, how much time we got? 14 minutes? Yeah, I can beat the boss. Okay, so let's start the boss battle. Um, doo -doo -doo. It requires 40 golden spatulas, but obviously we got that taken care of. Ta-da! And then we go to the industrial park. The industrial park. And now we fight. See how we fought Robo Sandy last time. Which was actually Randy Savage. Get it, brother! <laughs> now I'm just gonna fight Hulk Hogan real quick. That's cool. Whatever. 
Because you're not a Hulkamaniac! Uh, no he won't. Come on, you little hoaxster! Come on! <laughs> Brother. <laughs> Brother. Okay, I have not fought Robo Patrick in a while. Yeah, Robo Patrick, he's easily the worst of the main, like, I don't know. Of the main bosses, he's like, I don't know, the least fun. Because it's just, it's really bland and tedious. Because basically what he does is he goes around, spins in a circle for however long. Then you just throw a bubble at him. That's the ticket! There you go. And he just throws goo at you. That's it. But see, this is what I call goo. Not the freaking water from before, you know. This is goo. Goo. The big gooey spongy delight. <laughs> oh, Oh, trust me, he will change tactics. See that thingy above him? Well, you know. Things are gonna get a little serious. Come on! Come on, brother! I don't know. I always mix up Hulk Hogan and Macho Man for some reason. And then, Frozen. Oh, God, Sandy, your eyes! Yeah, her, her, like, I have never seen dialysis that insane. So anyway, what they want you to do is constantly hit these, um, hooks because they drop boxes. And that's because when you hit Patrick in this phase, when you hit him, he does this. He goes up and hits that thing, and now he can't stand on it anymore. And now he's vomiting. And you just have to keep doing this, because... He breaks the gosh dang boxes, so you just have to keep doing it over and 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 over for this phase, and if you're not lucky enough, you just don't get hidden. Dude, announcer man, spoilers! Why would you do that to such casual audience? The only reason they want you to put SpongeBob back in is because then at this point, because he can't get in there, then you have to use the bubble bowl. I only did the bubble bowl just because I felt like it. And dead. There you go. So now he breaks this thing. Yep. So now he shoots ice waves at you. Yeah, he does that attack on you. Yeah, but the one thing I don't like about this part of the fight is when he stops. Oh. I thought I was about to stop. Ugh, I have to do that all over. Fresh like a spinning breeze. Okay.
Ugh! I can't... I actually can't hit him. There we go, finally. Ah, my ears are hurting. Hold on, let me take a let me take a moment. There you go. Ah, my ears need a moment to cooperate, to recuperate. They're stinging super bad. Here we go. This is much easier to manage. It is time to play some PlayStation games. Stop going over here. Okay, this might actually be easier to hit. Ear. Alright, one more hit! One more hit! What? Okay. One more hit! One more hit! We just need one more hit and it's over. It's over. And then at that point, I can do whatever I want with the cruise bubble. Give me the cruise bubble! There's another opportunity for Spongebob, baby. It's time to let the coup de gras. The coup... Shit. However, it seems like I can't even hit this guy. Because, number one, Spongebob keeps lurching forward like a joik. No! I fucked up everything. See, that's the problem with this fight. He can twist around. When he turns around, he can just put himself in goddamn stupid angles where you can't hit him. Okay, I can hit him there. SpongeBob has an opportunity here. Yes, it's over! Yeah, okay, let's just stop watching that. And, okay. So, wow, I've been going on for for 23 minutes. Jesus, fuck. Alright, well, now we have the... Oh. I've never heard this before. So I just heard Mr. Lawrence go completely insane. Alright, well, we're just gonna go over and uh, nab this. There you go. But anyway, uh,. Next time on Spongebob Battle for Bikini Bottom, uh, well actually, I'm gonna... There you push L, get the cruise bubble, there you go. Alright, so anyway, next time on Spongebob Battle for Bikini Bottom, we are going to be going to... Kelp Forest. I'll see y'all next time, only you can prevent forest fires.